Hello friend, welcome to my channel Quest for Education. Today I am discussing 10 mathematics questions for the student who is preparing for the Johor Navadaya Vidyalay entrance exam 2023. Let's start and before we start one thing I would remind you that don't forget to subscribe my channel. Question number 1. The smallest four digit number formed by the digit 0, 2, 4 and 7 is. So friend, we have to form four digit smallest number so we have to write smallest digit first that is 2 after that 0 after that 4 after that 7 so a is the right answer question number 2 sum of two numbers is 11,009 if one number is 9,999 the other number is so friend we have to subtract 9,999 from 11,009 so we write it 11,009 we subtract 9999 so friend 0 1 0 1 so friend a is the right answer question number 3 the smallest five digit number beginning with 14 and exactly divisible by 13 is so friend we have to write smallest five digit number beginning with 14 so the number is 14 after that 30 so friend we have to divide this number by 13 1 13 10 0 100 We get 12 as a remainder. So friend, we have to subtract 12 from 13 and add the resulting number with this number 14,000. So my answer is 14,000 14, plus 1. That is 14,001. So B is the right answer. Question number 4 sum of the fractions 4 upon 3, 5 upon 9 and 1 upon 3 is. So friend, 4 upon 3 plus 5 upon 9 plus 1 upon 3. So friend, 9 as a LCM. So 12, 9, 1, 1 into 5 that is 5 plus 3, 3 multiplied 1 that is 3. That is 20 upon 9. So friend, D is the right answer. Question number 5. 6.125 when change into fraction become. So friend, the number is 6.125. Eliminating point, we get 6.125 upon 1000. So 25 to 4. 5 upon 40 again 4 8 49 that is 49 upon 8 that is 6 and 1 8 so friends C is the right answer question number 6 in an examination it is required to get 270 of the aggregate marks to pass a student get 216 marks and is declared failed by 8 percent marks what is the maximum aggregate marks a student can get? So friend, 6 pass marks, 270 student get, get 216, so filled by Fifty four marks. Student also get failed by eight percent marks. So according to question, eight percent equal to fifty four. So eight percent equal to fifty four. One percent equal to fifty four four upon eight and hundred percent equal to fifty four. 
54 upon 8 multiplied by 100 so friend that is 25 upon 2 27 so 5 17 67 675 so a is the right answer question number 7 three bells start ringing together at 8 30 am if they ring after 4 minutes, 5 minutes and 6 minutes respectively, the next time they will ring together. So friend, first we take LCM of 4, 5 and 6 minutes. So 4, 5 and 6. LCM 2, 2, 5, 3. So friend, LCM 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 3. 60 minutes. That is one hour. So friend, we have to add one hour with 8.30 am. So it's become 9.30 am. So B is the right answer. Question number 8. In how many years will rupees 2000 amount to rupees 2400 at the rate of 5% per annum at simple interest? So friend, Principal that is 2000 amount 2400 rate 5% so interest that is A minus P that is 2400 minus 2000 that is 400 so time T I multiplied by 100 by P into R so I that is 400 into 100 upon P 2000 multiplied by R that is 5. So friend 0 0 0 0 20 4. So, so friend 4 year. So B is the right answer. Question number 9. The floor of a rectangular room is 15 meter long and 12 meter wide. The room is surrounded by a baranda of wide 2 meter on all its sides. The area of the baranda is. So friend, first we take a picture of this room. So friend, here room 15 meter long and 12 meter wide. So friend, the length of the baranda including room become 15 to meter this side, 2 meter this side that is 19 meter and the wide of the baranda become 12 meter, 2 meter this side, 2 meter this side that is 16 meter. So friend, area of Baranda including including room that is 19 multiplied by 16 so friend 14 16 14 304 meter square area of room that is 15 into 12 that is 180 meter square so friend area of baranda that is 304 less 180 that is 124 meter square so friend, D is the right answer. Question number 10. The average of 5 numbers is 281. The average of the first 2 numbers is 280. And the average of last 2 numbers is 278.5. What is the third number? So friend, average of 5 numbers 
281 sum of five numbers that is 281 multiplied by 5 that is 5014 average of of first two numbers 280 sum of first two numbers that is 280 multiplied by 2 that is 0 6 560 average of last two numbers that is 278.5 so sum of last two number that is 278.5 multiplied by 2 that is 0 0.7 five 557.0 so sum of first and last two sum of first two numbers and last two numbers that is 560 plus 557 that is 7 1 1117 so third number is 0 5 less 1117 8 2 so friend so friend third number is 288 so d is the right answer thank you for watching have a good day